Hey guys, uh, what's going on? So, I just, um, wanted to do a video reviewing my car tour. Uh, basically everything, uh, that's in the car itself. So, like, uh, I'm just gonna review that. So, it's the stuff that's, like, mainly not uh, in use right now. But, like, if anything were to happen, you know, that kind of stuff. So, I'm gonna go and show you guys. So, here we go. Starting off from the trunk. Uh, right now, I just came back from a trip, but hold on. So, um, all this is my trip gear. So, like, this is my brother's stuff. So, I got some towels, a bag, canoe thing because we were on a canoe, uh, and then a changing pad over there. Uh, my jacket's back in there, but uh, it's, it's kind of messy right now because we just got back from a trip. But uh. all right, so this is the setup that I'm currently running, um, basically all just in a drawer, uh, right, right here, and then my belt is right here, and I've showed you all that, uh, before in another video, I think it was my first video, so, uh, and then in here, that's gonna be the grand finale, so I'm gonna show that later, but right now I'm gonna open that, this thing, okay, so, in there, First of all, over here, I've got a first aid medical kit. Uh, it has worked for me in the past uh, for my uncle or anything like that. Hold on. Give me one sec. Oh, gosh. Hold on, guys. I'm so freaking sorry. Okay. Here we go. We're all good, guys. Okay. Um, uh, Alright, so, anyways... <laughs> That's the first aid kit, and then right here I have two pieces of range gear, so my sunproof headset, and then my seminal cap, and then I've got my plate carrier. By the way, I got new shades on my plate carrier. Not the blue ones anymore. I kind of like them. Um, so I've got that set in here, and I've got my firearm on the side, and my helmet uh, right here. Um, so just easy access in here for any of that stuff. So I'll leave that open for the mystery thing right here in a second. Um, coming... Yeah, I'm gonna come over to the side. So, this whole door is basically full of stuff. I'm gonna start from the top. I just have my uh, black mask and my wallet. Then I have some medical gloves, uh, some tactical gloves back here. And then a extra cuff case. I don't know if y'all can see my cuffs back there, but... Uh, and then over here in the cup holder, I've got just some baby powder to wipe sand off or anything. Uh, I'm going to take this out in a second, but I've got a nail kit. Oh, jeez. For my mom, whenever she needs that. And I've got a medical mask over there. I think it's an N95. And then some more gauze. All right, so... I'm going to show you all that, so, first little, like, container of things, let's see, so, we've got some, got some different size gauze bandages, all that stuff, some trauma shears, um, and I think on the other side, I have some, like, earwax, uh, equipment, but, so, some random gauze in there, I think, what is this, um, split sponges, and then over here, more small bandages, more wipes, um, yeah, more of those. Um, so that goes in the first little, uh, like, spot, like, right there. Uh, and then also right here, I just have some guard, there's some double layer construction absorbs in this here's forward. Um, what is this, though? Okay, yeah, some gauze pads. There we go. Gauze pads. Uh, so that just goes snug in the corner. Just like that. So that is the driver side or passenger side door, the one I'm sitting on mostly. Um in here, if I open this baby up, I've got a kit and some earbuds uh, for traveling and then some driver's info down here. Uh, but in this little kit thingy, hold on, so in this little kit, hold on, give me one sec, just 
make sure nothing's missing. Uh, but anyways, in this little kit right here, uh, I am carrying some masks it's for COVID-19. Um, I don't know what that is, there, but some wipes right there. And then, if y'all can see that, down here, I've got some hand sanitizer. I don't know what it's doing down there, usually on the side. And then, more hand sanitizer right there there uh what else i think that's just about it i usually carry like one pen in here but um that is the kit that goes in the glove compartment which is right here i have thought about maybe snugging a flashlight in there but um i don't know if i should do it yet once I turn on comments, I wanna I wanna let y'all um ask if I should sh um snug a flashlight in there just you know for roadside. But uh, so that's in the glove compartment. Let's see what else do I have. This is our regular stuff. So oh, okay. So this isn't really a visor organizer or anything. Uh, it's just like a visor pull down uh utility kit. Uh, so I've got a multi tool. In here, uh, and then just some quick accessing medical gloves. Uh, I've got an army patch and an American flag patch, and then also I've got the regular visor too. Oh, there's. Well, there goes that. Hang on. Okay, back to normal. But I've got like that little visor thing. Um, that's about it, actually. Except for the surprise item. That's basically all I'm carrying as far as medical and tactical stuff goes. Uh, I don't know if y'all can see me. Hello? But, um, anyways, what is in this? Okay, here we go. Here we go. Just FYI, this is a toy. I think it's a Nerf toy. Well, that just gave it away, but, um,. It fits in this bag extremely well. I call it my gun bag. Um, oh, by the way, tomorrow's Easter, guys. Well, the day I'm filming this, it is the day before uh, Easter uh, for 2021. Um, so it is the day before Easter. The day before Easter, and tomorrow I will be getting an Airsoft AR-15 to replace that little, like, toy... Machine gun, that I call it in my videos. Because I think that's what it is. But, um, that might go in the newly re released, uh, gun bag right here. But anyways, here's the gun bag. That's what it looks like unzipped. And when I open it, as you can see, we've got, um, a sniper. So, orange tip, and just a sniper. And then back here, in a little pouch, I've got two Velcro thingies right here. And then my scope. So, that is in the, uh, that is what's in the, like, I guess, gun bag. I want to call it a gun bag. I really don't know what it's called, though. But I've seen, like, officers have, like, special bags. I don't know what they call them, though. I really don't. But anyways, it has this, like, two, like, straps right here. So, it can go around your back. Hold on. Like... That, I don't know if y'all can see that, but it goes around your back. <clears throat> so, whenever, like, um, I'm, like, rushing to a scene, I can carry that on my back. Um, so that's about it. Let me just, I want to see my cat. Hold on. I'd want some attention. Fred, Fred, what are you doing, man? Hold on, guys. So this is Fred. Fred, say hi to the camera. Uh, he's a very cute little kitty. Well, he's not a kitty anymore, but, you know, he's, he does a good job around the house. He's eating armadillos, protected uh, the family, almost like our guard dog, but it's our cat. Um, he's a tuxedo. 
white and black, and he's uh, overall a very good cat, and now he's licking my leg. Okay. Um, but so, we're gonna go inside. We're gonna have some fun cuddling together, and uh, I guess I'll see you guys on the next one. Peace, guys.